All right, hey guys, OFD checking in here, and yeah, it's the second video of Friday. I gotta get videos done while I can, and so this is the second one. Now, guys, I'm running out of room for, for watches, I gotta admit, at my house, and so I've kind of wanted to have a... I got a watch stand that was made by one of my best viewers out there, Chris Wells. Thank you. He's made a couple watch stands for me, and I use it constantly, but I did want to have a nice wooden watch box right at the side of my bed, so I went looking on Amazon... And, you know, prices for watch boxes really vary quite a bit. If you get into the Wolf, you're getting up there into some really high prices. I, I've looked at the Song Mix here on the channel. I've got a couple of those, and I really do like their watch boxes quite a bit. But I wanted something made out of solid wood. And this is from a company called Nori. It's N-O, uh, capital N, little O, big R, I. That's it. N-O-R-I. No re, I guess is the way you pronounce that. But these watches are about $50 on Amazon. And I have to admit, uh, this came while I was traveling for work this week. And I was really excited to get it open. When I got home yesterday and I got to open it, I was really, really impressed. So let me just show you the watch box really quick. Talk about it for a minute. I'll leave a link down below where you can pick one of these up on Amazon. Because I do think it's a it's a really, really nice watch box for the money. So go ahead and just take a quick look at it. It is a solid wood watch box. I mean, this thing definitely has quite a bit of heft to it. I'm not exactly sure what type of wood this is made out of, but it's very nicely done. It has a beautiful finish on it. There's no you know sharp edges or anything. All the edges have been rounded off very nicely. It does have a, a nice glass top on it. And it has, what I was really impressed with was the hardware, uh, you know, on this on this case it has extremely heavy duty hardware on it that actually this one is like hinged and locks in over here you've got a locking plate down here it actually has a lock on it um, this is a five watch holder so this is you know if you guys got a five watch collection i'm actually kind of jealous of you because i got way too many watches um, but this is be going to be a really nice watch box that you can display your watches in if you have any solar watches or eco drives or solars the nice thing is you have this glass top that the uh, the sun or the light can go through and actually charge your watches so the pillows are very nicely done very nice material on all the pillows they're not too big um, for the slots so your watch is going to fit on there nicely and what I thought was really cool is let's check this out this is the key this is the way they send it to you this is the way the key comes in the box and so you can lock this thing up um, keep people out of it I always laugh about a locking watch box because unless you have it bolted to something somebody's just going to pick up the whole watch box and take off with it but it's cool. It's neat that um, it comes with this key and it locks like that. I think it's a really nice watch box, especially for the money. And like I said, it is heavy duty. You're not going to have a problem with this watch box. On the bottom of it, you have this nice felt layer here, so it's not going to scratch up anything. You know, you set this watch box on. But for the price of $49, I think it's a great deal on this box. Like I said, I'm going to leave a link down below where you guys can check this one out. I'm gonna go ahead and pause it real quick here and stick a few watches in here so you guys can get an idea of what your watches are gonna look like this in the box. People are always asking me, you know, how big are the pillows compared to the watches? And so I think the best way to kind of show you that is to just drop some watches here in the box and let you see what it looks like. So let me pause it and get some watches in here for you. Just a second, guys. All right, guys, so there you go. That's what the watch box is going to look like with watches in it. I have to admit, if you guys have a five-watch collection, you're doing pretty good. You're not going overboard. It's probably a cool thing. So um, this is what they look like. Now, this one is a little bit squished because I have a seven-inch wrist, and, it, and to be able to buckle it on the pillow, uh, I had to kind of squeeze the pillow down. But everything else, because they've got, they're on a rubber strap or a leather strap, fits in there nicely. Quite a crazy collection I had sitting out here in the office uh, just now. So... We got the we got the Breitling, we've got the Nautis Avalon, we've got the Tavis, the the, the blue dial Tavis. It's funny, I watched uh, Marshall Times video. He borrowed this watch from me, and he did a review of it. And as soon as I watched the review, I had to go get it and wear it for a day. Always blown away by how good of time this twenty three dollar watch keeps. And we've got a uh, the Mako over here, the Mako Two from Orient, and we've got the Spinnaker Sorrento over here. So kind of a diverse collection here in the box. But the main thing I wanted to show you guys was the box itself and how nicely these watches fit into the box and how nice the box actually looks itself. For a price of forty nine dollars, just under fifty actually, you can get this watch box shipped to you, and I think you're really getting a good deal for your money. Probably one of the nicest watch boxes I have at the house right now. No, I, it, it is the nicest watch box I have at the house right now. So that's the video, guys. This is the No Re uh, wooden, solid wooden watch box, lockable, very nice hardware. Excellent, excellent uh, unit for the money. Definitely go check them out. I will leave a link down below in the bottom where you can pick one of these up. If you guys like the video, give me a thumbs up down there at the bottom. And if you have not subscribed to the OFD channel yet, please do. Please do. Thanks, guys.